Hi guys, this is a follow up to a previous video I made called I Have a Big Fat Dock. I basically showed my dock inside Windows XP, showed how I got it configured and the applications I had installed and I also showed the Stacks Docklet which was the applications popping out. Now that was Windows XP, uh, this time I'm on Windows Vista and I have my dock configured slightly differently. Now the main thing about this video is that I'm actually using Rocket Dock to replace the taskbar and the start menu. So how did I go about doing it? Well firstly, you notice in my previous video I had them all categorized. Uh, this time I just got one click access to the applications I commonly use and the places. I've got them separated by separators um, in different things like uh, pictures, audio, video. Um, I'm aiming to add some more applications soon. Now on the right hand side I have the clock, the rocket dock clock applet. You just right click, add item, rocket dock clock docklet. And it basically is a replacement to the clock that you'd have in your taskbar. Now next to that you'll see that I have some very, very small icons. Now these are all my status bar icons. And uh, this is done by something called KK menu. All I did was go to uh, setup tray and then enable tray support on this icon and you can set an image for it as well and I just set a random one which is the computer provided by Rocket Dock. So I can then use any of these status bar icons if I want. Now you'll notice as I go over this bit it says Kane BT taskbar and start menu remover. Now that's the thing that's removing my taskbar and my start menu. So if I was to press the Windows key it doesn't actually do anything but if I was desperate to access my start menu I'd press control and escape and it opens up the start orb like it would normally and it shows me all the applications inside it. Click away and it's gone. Now um, what you can also do if you really need to use this Windows key because this application disables that as well if you need to use things like Windows Run or something like that um, you just right click and then say suspend hotkeys so then I say Windows key and R and then it brings up my run dialog. Now um, that is just removing the start bar and um, the, sorry the task bar and the start menu so then what happens about minimizing windows because as we've got no taskbar now rocket dock has the option to minimize windows to the dock which is really really good i've also got as you notice because i've got firefox open it's got a little arrow underneath it very very similar to mac um, tiger and leopard um, basically i ticked running application indicators and it basically shows it underneath and it shows all the ones that i have open um, so I've got minimize windows to the dock so when I minimize uh, this video that I just showed um, it basically minimizes itself to the right hand side and you can see that it shows in the label it shows exactly what I have so I can have loads of different applications open minimize them and they come here now this is great I love this feature because um, there's so many times I've been wanting to have open applications and minimize them to my tray without using software or anything like that um, but this enables me to do it inside the dock. So those are the docklets that I'm using and that I'm replacing my start menu and my taskbar with. Um, if you have any suggestions on any other docklets for Rocket Dock, then please, uh, by all means, leave a comment. So thank you for watching my video. Please comment, rate, subscribe if you like my videos. And thanks again.